Welcome to Teshin, a suburb of the greater Accra region of Ghana. It's a festival season and there is a lot of traffic in town. Also, there is a lot to eat, a lot to drink, great fancy dresses, great talents to exhibit and so many more things installed in this particular blog. My name is Edmond. I'm a Ghanaian YouTuber promoting tourism, businesses and making fun videos up onto my YouTube channel. So if this is your first time on my channel, don't forget to click on the subscribe button and click on the notification bell so that whenever I upload a video, you'll be notified that I've uploaded a video. Today, I'm bringing to you a video of the festival celebrated in Teshin in the month of August and September. But I couldn't film the detailed festival which I'm making arrangements for it next year to bring you the entire documentary. But today, let's enjoy what they call Panshimo. But before that, let's start all over. guys so this is a festival celebrated by the people called Gans in the greater Accra region of Ghana this particular one is of the people called Teshin uh, also in the greater Accra region what you see the man carrying is called Sisi others call it Chisi now you can drop money into this thing and the water will be poured on you just to symbolize blessing long life now these people you also see are a group of people who are just running about the whole town and uh they are like they are, basically they are following the tc now what you see the man also carrying there is what symbolizes them others have the flag others have different things that symbolize them and others have different colors some are even soldiers you see some people wearing uh, soldier uniform they are not soldiers they are also a group of people who are also celebrating the festival through this what we call panashimo okay so that chase is going to finally um uh, I don't know how to put it about at the end of the video you are going to see it uh, we call it a abu so it will finally go and settle if I should say something like that around 6 p.m. in the evening then all these people will be running with it so these people are running after it and as it is also going to uh, a abu <laughs> something basically like that so these people are just running and these are different groups this and this one part of a group there will be other groups you'll be seeing also they'll be running about just singing uh, jubilating and some of the songs that they sing are meaningful a lot of the songs are meaningful but some of the songs like you know these people call the guys all right so that's another part of uh, a group this is another part of a group and you saw their symbol everybody has what they are carrying but the main thing that is uh, centered on the festival is what you saw about it is i love these guys that like <laughs> sort of a craziness for me i find it fun i'll try to see but for the same guys this is the festival called uh, uh, homo war it's it's a festival celebrated to hoot at anger um history having that some years back there was great hunger among the guns so uh they pray to their ancestors the gods and the gods had their prayers listen to their prayers and after that there was abundance of food so when the food came the hoot at anger that is known as the homo war which is hooting at anger with, to celebrate the food in abundance they've gotten so this is celebrated every year and there's different types of guns uh in, in the greater Africa. we have the usu the teshin the nungwa the Labadi and Stema and so many other people also over there. But like I said earlier, I'll try and get you the entire documentary God will in next year where we we'll get in depth history about the people of the guys, why they celebrate this festival. Until then, catch you later.
now guys this is where the tc or the cc will have to come and finally settle at what the guy is carrying uh, we will have to come and be poured into this particular tunnel if i should say so that is it passing as it's passing it's going to the seaside first the sea is very close to where i was standing here and shooting this video the sea is very very close so it's going to the seaside and as the people the group are also following it uh, or him the person carrying it so it is going to the seaside going to perform some rides and uh, customs then after that it will come to this uh tunnel once again uh, if i should mention but before that all these people are the flags like the different groups these are different groups having their flag and they are all struggling to be the first person to use their flag like to dip their flag into the tc what the guy is carrying so if you are the first person to dip yours into it it generally means that there's there's blessing upon your group uh to the next year that it will be done again so they will be struggling this is a serious struggle that is being done over there now the chase will come and it will like gradually come and you, know, have, you see that thing like <laughs> it will come and like uh, uh yeah, pour what is the person will come and pour what he's carrying into this particular channel but guys this is a very wonderful festival you should try and come to ghana one of these days if you're in ghana also try and visit Tashi during this festival and you will love it it's very very great festival but yes you have to be extra careful when you're there but until then guys don't forget to click on the subscribe button hit on the post notification but i have great stuff to bring to you more festivals to bring to you more videos more fun stuff to bring to you until then see you another time peace and much love to everybody